In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the free online AstroClick travel service which is an amazing high quality astrocartography service from the creators of astro.com website. Uh, you will benefit before viewing this tutorial from viewing my other tutorial which explains how to use free online services at astro.com but I will, I will give you a link to that tutorial. Uh, in the description of this uh, of this video. Uh, so we start by th the easiest way to find the service is just to Google for AstroClick Travel. And here we have it in the first uh, search result. We just click and come to this amazing page. Well, I already have a couple of profiles created here for Keanu Reeves, for Arnold Schwarzenegger. How they were created you will see in that other video, I will give you a link to it. But it's very convenient to have your own uh, like workplace on the internet for astrological purposes. And here you have a very high quality astro cartography map. It's, it's not some, some people write in the group that uh, astro click lines or something. It's, it's just an astro cartography map, nothing else, but of a very good quality. Like uh, it, this one was created for Keanu Reeves, it can be created for you as well. And you see the, the lines, the planetary lines showing where uh, the, the planets would appear uh, culminate or be on the horizon if you relocate to those places. There are also these circles like this one. They show where the planet, in this case Jupiter, will, will be on the, uh, in the zenith, at, at the top of the world, so to say, uh, and where the, the influence of this planet will be the strongest. Uh, Chiron, for example, will be for Keanu Reeves here in, in the South America. Uh, Jupiter will be on the midheaven for him here in the, somewhere in Africa, and so on. So the, these circles with crosses show where the planets uh, appear in, in the zenith. Uh, Mars and, and Venus for him would be in, in India. Uh, and, and the influence of those planets in these locations will be the strongest, but it will be still very strong along the lines of the planets on the midheaven. So, uh, how we navigate around this map? Just by clicking and dragging, very easy. And if we want to zoom in, we just zoom in, pressing this plus, or zoom out, pressing this minus. And this is very, very convenient. Because I've seen many uh, astrological programs that uh, allow you to work with astrocartography, like solar maps, part of Solar Fire, and others, and they're not as convenient and contemporary as, as this very, very useful web interface, and it's free, you know, it's amazing. So, uh, you might be interested, for example, what, what, what's the potential of at Ottawa for... for uh, this person. We click on it and we have a detailed description. We, and if we click to show details, we'll see these crossings. And crossings are very interesting because if in this location you see that no planetary lines are passing through this location, but there are still crossings uh, passing through it. And those crossings are called parans in astrocartography, but that's explaining what they are takes takes uh, a, a lesson. So um, I do recommend you to, to click on this show details and to read for any locations you are interested in what, what says the, the, this, this description. You can click on some line and it will be Jupiter on the ascendant line and there is a, a useful interpretation that will tell you what's what, what this line can can bring into your life or into the person's life. And you can further zoom in, click on different lines, and read what they mean. And crossings are also very useful, and they're interpreted. You see, there is an interpretation of what they mean. In some location, you don't have any lines, but you still have some crossings and Venus Jupiter crossings is especially nice and and so on so there is a lot of 
information for you just at this very basic level but let's say you you want to move to the east coast of your, the united states to to new york perhaps and there are no lines here and you are can reefs for example okay and uh, what you can do you can click these boxes add harmonious and disharmonious aspects these will show you where uh, planets form major aspects to to the angles of relocation chart basically and you will see that there is some line which is Pluto square the ascendant coming not far from New York maybe that's not the best the, not the most pleasant line but there are other lines as well you can choose what you like but there is some information about the location and you can click it and Pluto square ascendant. Well, there's no interpretation for it, but um, you still know that there is some specific influence typical for that location. So this is it. You can use this very convenient and very advanced and very good quality service for free from anywhere in the world. So I highly recommend it to you, especially you, if you're a beginner in, in locational astrology.